Libra, getting ready to do your weekend update. This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, and Rising. All right, Libra. You have the Two of Wands, the King of Cups, the Knight of Wands, the King of Coin. Wow, and the Two of Cups. Wow, Libra. Under the deck is the Fool card. So for some of you, if you're going out, you may meet a water sign and an earth sign. You may be trying to figure out if this person's a player. This may be one person you already know and you're still trying to figure out if this person's a player, Libra. I feel like you have feelings for them, but you can't tell if they have feelings for you. Uh, this person may be, they may work a lot or you think they work or they tell you they work is what I'm getting. And then at the same time, they're very romantic if it's the same person. If this is just one person, they may be very busy. That's what I'm seeing here with the King of Coin. But let's go back around and see. Um, and six of Swords, Five of Wands. Yeah. Oh, wow. Okay. This one here is because what I was picking about this person, they may not be a Capricorn. They may not be an Earth sign. But they do work a lot. Guy or girl, this person is very obsessed about what they do. And in fact, to the point where I think you kind of think they're lying. You wonder if they really are at the office. Are they really working? Yeah, they work a lot to the point of that it's an obsession. They probably overwork. They do chase the money. They like it. Um, that's what gets them up in the morning. It gets them, you know, out the door. They love that kind of stuff, okay? They'll put that in front of you. And it's not necessarily money. It's just they enjoy working. It gives them, you know, satisfaction. They may chase deals. They may move around a lot or travel, I should say, is what kind of what I'm getting for new deals or for work. Um, this causes a lot of problems in your life, in your love life. One, because they're gone a lot, but two, I think you don't trust them. You're also, some of you are afraid that they're, what, what are they doing when they're gone? This person may also be, now, some of you may be dealing with two different people, but you're not getting along with either of them. They're not the right ones for you. Maybe you're just getting to know them. Maybe you're just communicating online. However it is, this spread is showing that neither one right now is the right one for you, and it's better for you to move on and find someone else. Neither of these people or your quote soulmate or that one person that you really want to see eye to eye with. I mean, no one's perfect, but these two people have too many problems for you to deal with them. Like meaning they're just not meant for you. Though if it's the same person, you're just dealing with one person here. When, when they are around, they're very sweet and romantic, but you guys argue all the time. So they're gone a lot. They work a lot. Their schedule varies a lot. You don't even know when they're going to be there. <coughs> Excuse me. But they are working a lot. But this is showing me that to move on, because if you are choosing between two people, you don't have the two choices. You need to move on and find someone completely new. What is the Ace of Cups, Two of Cups? Ace of Cups, Two of Cups. Who is this Ace of Cups, Two of Cups? Page of Wands. Okay, so under the deck is an Eight of Coin. So there may be a fire sign. Um... For some of you, this might be someone in your past coming back. Three of Wands, can you see that? Others of you, this is just where you go. It could, they could, if you have children, they may, they may be at the same daycare that you're at, or they drop your kid, their kids off there. For some of you, like the Eight of Coin isn't work. It's about, like I always say, school, volunteering, the gym. If there's a daycare at the gym, their kids may be there also, is what I'm seeing with the Six of Cups. But, and again, they're very outgoing with the Page of Wands. They may or may not be a fire sign. doesn't matter. They're just very fun. So this would be a better choice if you know who this person is. This also um, could be someone coming in, like I had mentioned, because we do have the Three of Wands under there. For some of you, you may already know this person with the Six of Cups. They may be, like, at the coffee shop or something. They're, they're flirtatious. I'm not saying this is necessarily like the next Mr. or Mrs. or the soulmate or anything. It's just you have a better opportunity with this person with the Ace of Cups and Two of Cups being there than with the ones you're dealing with now that you're hoping is Mr. or Mrs. Right. This new one is a better choice. That's all this spread is saying. So I'm going to leave it there. Have a great week, you guys, and take care.